Hi everyone and welcome to some more Poet Patron Server episode. I know I've only just done one of these but so much has happened that I feel like it needs another update. And um, the first thing is look, books. And while I was digging this area I found some diamonds and I mined the obsidian so we can make an enchanting table now. And I got the books because someone was on the server and they had given me dye uh, the brown and the black and they said did you need anything else and I was like yeah I do need a book actually and they gave me three books as well which was extremely kind of them and now I can do my enchanting table and over here I finished this wall I put um, polished andesite because it went with the other polished blocks and opposite is where I'm planning to do the enchanting area so I'm just starting to dig it out now and I thought I might grow the reeds in here as well um, and while I was doing the pumpkin area I thought you know what other people might want pumpkins so I thought I could just put a little shop next to the wool shop oh, it's getting daylight so that's good and um, make a little tiny pumpkin area over there which is what I have done so I'll show you that but the interesting thing that I think you need all to be updated is, is Project Revitalization, which is, um, i trying to remember who it was, I think it's Vanilla Donut that came up with this um, Project Revitalization, which is in three phases of doing the, the server up, I think because it's summer and people have got time on their hands to do it. And um, it, it's brilliantly written shows you what you you can be doing and even if you can't try if you can't do the stuff you can contribute um, um, blocks that they need so that's what I've been doing so this is the pumpkin shop this is my little pumpkin area because I'm growing so many pumpkins there's um <laughs> there's lots of jack-o-lanterns everywhere because I thought well I might as well put them down and it looks better than torches all around it has made the area really big and with the um, dyes, I've got dark grey and light grey. I think it's just grey and light grey, isn't it? Sh sheep, and I've got black sheep, and they're going quite well. So over here, where the new house was, look, a new wall has emerged. Now, I have tried doing the pattern. I had tried help helping out. I couldn't do it. I just made a mess of it all. Um, so what I have done instead is I filled the hole that was over there and uh, there's some iron golems here lots of dogs as well which is quite sweet and uh, that's the pattern which was fine this side i was okay having a go at that pattern and then when you go the other side it's a very complicated pattern which i couldn't work out properly so i just took down what i did and just filled in the hole that was here for them and i've um, given them lots of um, resources so they can finish it off so that's the pattern that i got confused about I think it was up on a hill as well, it didn't help when it was going to go down, it was very, very complicated. So lots happening on the server, lots of people doing repairs and sorting stuff out. And the other thing I wanted to show you, which is very intriguing, is this here over here. So I thought, oh, this is all. At first I thought it was part of the wall, but it's a different pattern. So I don't think it is, and it goes into the mountain. And then I remember somebody saying that they were building a base on a mountain. I thought, ah, so this is the base they're, they're building on the mountain. So I thought, I'll just go and have a look, see what the base is. All right, maybe they need a few blocks or something that I can help with. And look, portal. So this is in. This is very, very, very intriguing. And then the wall goes here. So I'm like, what's, what's going on? Aha! Do not enter, please. Ah, oh, so we won't enter. So this is their portal. So maybe the portal leads into the um, the spawn, which has really changed. And that's what we're gonna take a quick whiz round. And there is, as I say, somebody else. I don't know if I said that. Somebody else on the serve. There is somebody else. So we won't be able to sleep the night away, uh, which is a shame because I wanted to use my new bed because <laughs> I've got all these coloured walls. You can make a, you make your own bed now of the colour you want. So I've got an orange bed. I'm quite intrigued to see what that looked like. But yeah, they they've updated the map, um, which looked extremely complicated. And people have been um, going around 
doing repair work and sorting things out. So, um, the train track here, I don't know where that leads to, the train track. But hopefully this will always this will all link up with the new revitalization thing. But this um maybe stuff that we're on the wrong side of the wall could be a problem. <laughs> Intriguing. Diamond horse over there. So let's go this way. I think the, the question mark's the way you go in, isn't it? Yes. I'm getting to grips with it slowly. There's a big mammoth project going on over there, isn't there? Oh look, the strange things in the air because it's the the new version, the colour version, and we're getting really strange blocks appearing like that. Oh, we can get in here. That's that's handy. Uh, so this is uh, lots of things under construction. Sign shop. There was a flag shop I saw the other day when I was trying to drop off a few a few things. Oh, looks nice. Um, yeah, so they they all need to put all lighting down here because there's too many creepers spawning. But obviously you need to get glowstone that means going to the Nether. I think quite a lot of it's already gone. So this looks like um, someone's plot. Doesn't matter. Let's have a look. Brian, it's Brian's plot. It's got his name on it. <laughs> so this used to be the potatoes ink thing, didn't it? I think. Wrong way. Oh, my always facing the wrong way. Not dogs, bro. Possibly sign of red stick parrot Avery. Yes, because the other thing that happened is that they found a jungle on the other side of the um, border. Do you remember when we were going around the border? We said, "Oh, imagine if you saw a temple over there. Like, could you just extend it out a little bit?" Well, that's what they asked. And poet obliged, so um, they could get around to the other side, and that meant um, up for sale. I was Brian. Ah, so he's relocating over there. Ah, this is intriguing. So he wants to sell this. Ah, that's that's intriguing, isn't it? Because um, I know with my war shop, people were saying, you know, you should get a little property over in spawn to sell it. I was thinking, hmm, I think that's a bit too big for me. I was just kind of looking for a little shop. Yeah, so lots of things happening. I can't remember what I was talking about there. Got distracted by the sale sign. So this is new. I thought I'd, I'd give you a little tour around because so much has been happening. And so much going on. Oh, look, there's an ice thing here. Creeper spawn and boom. <laughs> Oh no, that's so sad. That's because it was dark, you see. They were on about lighting the place up because it was so dark. <laughs> and the boating thing. So where's our question mark? The question mark leads us home, doesn't it? So just a little tour. That's all you should have, seeing what's going on. Cause it's all sort of happening and um, things going on. It's a nice pattern, isn't it, there? There's a sense they must come on when it's night time, I think. That's what I was talking about, the border, wasn't I? So the border, um, that was it. Spotted this jungle, they wanted the border expended. Poet obliged. And, um, made it bigger and they, they managed to get to the border and find parrots which is very very exciting ah oh, so this is the pattern that i'm having trouble with this pattern here so it's on the other side that's a bit strange isn't it so that's protecting this side but not that side so i wonder how far it goes out before it comes back round. um yeah so they extended the border they got the Okay, they got the um, parrots and then they found a desert. And everyone's gone and dug up the desert. I said it's not very nice. People have been digging up the desert. <laughs> not nicely digging it up. Um, I wonder how I can get. Oh, I got through, didn't I? See, this is the thing. There needs to be more little openings. So I think my place is over 
here I think I might need to go and get the gauze I was hoping to do this all before it got dark it's supposed to be climb over the wall wouldn't we we'll just go to the end of the wall because we know at the end of the wall it finishes because <laughs> I've been having a go at it so I know it ends oh, that's clever doing it either side very clever people here oh, I can't get over yes you can just a block Right, so here it, here it goes. So this must lead to my place. Oh, little dog making a noise. Well, I know it's a little bit of a short episode, but I just thought it needed it needed doing because it needed to show you what was going on. So I'm not sure where that all goes to. At least we've solved the, the problem with the portal. We know that belongs to someone. So yeah, all I want is a little shop like this over there. I don't want a big Sure. And to be honest, it's not too far of a walk now, is it, for people to make the trek over? Hmm, just think about it, see if we've got any goodies. Right. I mean, at the moment, I've just got bones and string. Um, but I don't mind if people take it if they haven't got anything. I've got enough all there. The sheep are still congregating at one end of the, <laughs> of the um, sheep pen. Which is a bit annoying. Oh, that people look very alone, didn't it? Oh, get a bit jittery. I know he's doing something in the end farm, so maybe that's why. That's the other person. So here's our sheep, but there's our grey sheep. And that's the, um, the black sheep over there, and there's the dark. So that's what I call dark grey, and that's what I call light grey. But I think they could call that grey, and they just call this one light. Look, they all congregate this in. And I spent ages getting them all up the other end and breeding them up there, thinking, ah, oh, that'll sort it out, but it never did. So I've gone around putting, like I say, pumpkins down, make it a bit more lighter. Let's do that. And then next time, hopefully, we will see the um, enchanting area done. So I'll put a little few blocks around to keep it lit up. I'm really little pleased with my little place, I think it's lovely. <laughs> so thank you for watching and um, I will see you soon if you're playing on Poets Patreon server. Hope you're having a much fun as I am. <laughs> Bye!